How's it going anybody? It's Boypo and today I'm going to be showing you how to get high level snails or how to get snails overall here in Scorch Earth. So, let's get into it. Okay guys, and these snails are going to be cave snails, that's why we are here. And this is the cave of the destroyer, which is located on the church or the building in the desert, located at 78.4, 76.1. So for this you're going to need veggie caves. Now here for veggie cakes, this is going to be a problem because at least on official, bees are going to be glitched in the wall located here in the map, which is the only spawn area for them. So getting bee is going to be almost an impossible task, but some people have enough patience to render this render and get them out and tame them. So if you're lucky enough that somebody has honey on your server and you can trade for it, then you can make veggie cakes and get yourself these high level achatinas. Other than that, you're going to need a crossbow, you're going to need trank arrows, and a couple narcotics because since they're so high level, they take a little bit to tame. Other than that, you're going to need a cave mount. Now for this cave, we're going to be using a Tylo, but you can use a saver or a dire wolf. And once we have everything, we're going to head inside the cave as we're going now, and we're going to look for the Shatina that we want. Now remember, at least on this cave, oh, that's a bad lag, at least in this cave, there's Artoploras, there are Mantises, there are Onyxes, Titanoboas, and a lot of dangerous stuff, so we'll have to clear the area before taming the Achatina. And a quick reminder, if you have gear, take it off, that way the Artoploras cannot break it, because believe me, those gears get more and more expensive as we go. Okay, so we found our snail. Let me kill this bat real quick because I don't trust it. Bats are can be really annoying sometimes. Let me come on, die. They're pretty bad, but we're not taming bats today. Okay, there we go. So once we find the snail that we want, we're gonna equip our armor again. Just in case. And we're gonna start shooting it. So we want to shoot it until it goes back to his shell, and from there we want to shoot it on the Achatina itself, not the shell. Yeah, 290. Uh, the one that I have back on base, oh, it went down pretty quick. The one that I have back on base, it was at 295, so this one should come out around 400 as well. Then from here, we just put the video case. I'm not gonna lie, I forgot to bring narcotics, so this is gonna be interesting. That's going to be really annoying. But yeah, I'm going to continue taming and let's see. Finally, we got it. And sadly, it didn't go to over 400 because I accidentally hit it. But yeah, 362. And it's not going to dis disappear because the maximum is 500. So, now I put it on the base, put it on a cage, put it on wonder, and we're going to have cementing paste every hour around 100 cementing paste. So, yeah, pretty good if you ask me. So, guys, there you have it. That's how you tame a snail in Scorch Earth. 
So, with everything shown and said, that's gonna be everything for this video. Really hope you enjoy it, found it useful, and if you do, remember, leave a like, subscribe for more official videos, any questions or suggestions, leave them in the comment section below, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.